the Neisner Estuary lies within the Cape Floral Kingdom and is recognized as a principal environment for biodiversity. Tannin-stained streams flow into the system from the Yotaniqua Mountains, filtering gently through the salt marshes as the lagoon opens up, finally meeting the Indian Ocean at the rocky cliffs of the heads. The estuary is home to a dazzling kaleidoscope of underwater creatures that represents the very tapestry of life. Because of the sheer number of species found here, the Neisner estuary is considered South Africa's most important estuary in terms of biodiversity. The Neisner Basin Project was established in 1995 by Professor Brian Allenson with the aim to encourage research and conservation of the estuary. It was then also the Neisner Basin Project that launched the Neisner Seahorse Status Project in 2014 to study one of the most extraordinary animals that call this estuary home. The Neisner Seahorse, Hippocampus capensis. This unique creature is South Africa's only endemic seahorse species and is found in only three southern coast estuaries. It is this limited range, small population size, and habitat vulnerability that led to this species' endangered status on the IUCN Red List of Vulnerable Species. The Neisner estuary faces ongoing pressure from development and tourism. The Neisner Seahorse Status Project was established to investigate the current seahorse population in this ever-changing environment and to find out if this iconic species is thriving or merely surviving. The Neisner Basin Project runs a number of research projects which range from water quality to biodiversity assessments. Education is an integral part of our organization and through estuarine explorations, informative talks and conservation projects, we aim to educate and uplift the local communities in and around Neisner. The Neisner Basin Project is a non-profit organization and we rely on donations to keep our head above and below water. For more information or to make a donation, please visit our website.